Morning. Yeah, the shop is a mess. <laughs> uh, make sure I got my key. Yeah, I just unlocked the door. So, go in the house here and uh, say goodbye to Captain Morgan. Dogs are out here in the dog pen. Sorry if you can't see me. <laughs> uh, today's Thursday and uh, it's gonna be another hot one. I know everybody's complaining about the heat, but I'd rather have hot weather than 15 inches of snow and having to drive through it. So, yeah. Yeah, there's Mr. Morgan. He's not a happy boy. Well, he's getting better. Hi, Morgan. How are you? Can you say hi? Let's see if we can get him fired up here. Hmm? How are you? Pretty, pretty, pretty boy. Hmm? Can you sing? Yeah, I'll get him. Uh, he loves cashews. Oh, there he goes. See, I walked away. <laughs> I'll give him a cashew or two. You want a cashew? Hold on. Hold on. Hmm? No, he don't want a cashew this morning. Hard to tell him what he wants. <laughs> so yeah, he is, uh, he's been going through a process and uh, I'll be glad when it's over. He is in a better mood. Here you go. Yeah. Yeah, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's, that's for you, Mom, because she was asking how Captain Morgan's been. Let me uh, put these back away. Those are all natural cashews. They're not salted or anything, because then we'd have a bigger problem. So, well, I guess I'll go out to the shop and uh, get ready to go, because uh, uh, it's about that time. Whoops, sorry. I've had a couple cups of coffee, and uh, I gotta grab something out of the fridge outside and uh, get fired up and get going. Miss Linda's been at work for probably an hour and a half. Let me pause this here. And so, uh, some of you have been following along. Uh, my Husqvarna 48 inch mower, you know, probably three weeks ago, uh, I shelled the mower deck on it and um, I have not been able to find another mower deck. So this being August and at the end of mowing season coming, I, I really haven't been looking. I'm kind of hoping uh, later on in the season, things start slowing down. I might be able to find something then. So, yeah. For those of you that don't know, I was mowing out here and I think the mower deck had a crack in it and the center spindle broke, the mower deck actually broke and the, the whole center spindle came down on the ground. And that's where it sits. But uh, I have been blessed because uh, when I was laid up with my broken wrist uh, a 
neighbor of mine who works at a assembly plant and had some, well, it, doesn't t it didn't take him very long with the zero turn. Uh, he mowed my grass for me. Now he didn't weed eat or nothing like that, which is cool. I, I'm, I'm thankful that he mowed. And uh, yeah. But he called me yesterday and he says, hey, he says, uh, he says my wife noticed that uh, you had a post that you were looking for a mower deck or something. I think they follow my YouTube channel. I'm not sure. He says, hey, we're going to be out of town. He says, I have two zero turns. He said, I have a John Deere and I have this other one. And I said, he said, would you like to borrow one for the weekend? And I was like, heck yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I think he's going to bring it down, uh, this evening. Yeah. Uh, possibly, uh, before they leave to go out of town or, or whatever. So, this weekend, um, even though it's going to be hot as blazes, uh, again, probably. I think Sunday we're supposed to cool off, but, yeah, we're going to, uh, I'm going to have the use of a, well, you'll just have to wait and see. I know this is a motorcycle, whatever, but, uh, yeah, I've got to get my vest on, get the bike out, and, uh, Sorry if I'm making you dizzy, <laughs> but yeah. So uh, for those of you that ride motorcycles that do watch this channel, yes, I do wear a, a vest, okay? It's a leather vest. I'm not part of an MC. I'm not part of an organization, an MO, but and I've never caught any flack over this vest. I think I've talked to it about it before, uh, but hopefully uh, y'all can see that. I'm not a vet. Hopefully it's right side up. I don't know. If it's backwards, I apologize. And I'm not perfect. I'm just forgiven. forgiven. So yeah, here, here. Uh, this one's for Linda's uh, son that says, uh, yes, officer, I saw the speed limit. I just didn't see you. And then uh, Needles Highway, uh, don't mistake my kindness. Don't mistake kindness for weakness. And then uh, Iron Mountain, uh, American Truck Driving Association, and of course, watch me on YouTube, y'all. <laughs> so, knees over here in the front. Uh, if you if you've served our nation, thank you. And Sturgis 2019. Of course, I've been there uh, two or three other times after that, and. Uh, and then uh, I did the Bikers for Babies. We used to have a Bikers for Babies here in Kansas City, uh, marching, raising money for the Marching Dimes. And I used to raise money for that. And uh, yeah, can you hear my pet crickets? <laughs> so anyway, that's my best. Uh, no disrespect on MCs that wear cuts or anything like that. It's just an expression of me. So uh, I've never really caught any flack over it. I've actually had great comments uh, up in uh, Sturgis when I was wore it up there. So I actually, if I remember right, I actually walked down Main Street there and... Uh, Wore it right in front of a, well, it's a very, very well-known uh, MC. And it was, it was strange because there was, 
it was across the street and they there was a couple of uh, members on our side of the street that when we were walking down and I just I just casually walked by and say how you doing guys you know that was it one of them kind of chuckled and said something but I don't know I don't I didn't even pay attention I don't worry about it so look at that sunrise isn't that beautiful yeah so anyway i've got to get this thing fired up i gotta get my gloves on and uh i gotta get going oh crap let's see here come on i know you can close there we go <laughs> There's times when my, my hands are still a little bit weak. And uh, I have to struggle a little bit. <clears throat> but the good thing about the hot weather is I get to ride every day. Well, uh, I just want to wish everybody a, what is today? Uh, today's Thursday. And happy Thursday. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And, uh, you know, hit the thumbs up. This is, this is short and sweet. Uh, it's been a good week for trucking. Uh, yes, yesterday I was reflecting. I do that a lot when you drive a truck, but I was kind of reflecting on when I first got hired on and started driving truck. We didn't have air conditioning in the truck. The air conditioning was roll the windows down and they had one of those little fans on the dash that blew the hot air at you. Or even, uh, like around the floorboards and stuff, the seals would dry out and shrink. Had that nice hot air coming up on you driving down the road. And of course that was at night and it was still hot at night. Uh, so yeah, and then, you know, the, uh, I don't know. I think they came up with a rule with the, with the uh, FMCSA that, you know, if you're over the road that you had to have air conditioning because, you know, to stop and sleep and blah, blah, blah. And a lot of manufacturers, of course, was already doing that anyway. So, but I wasn't over the road. I was just out and back. I'd go to the terminal, work the dock for two, three, four hours, and then drive back, just depending on how far the run was. So I'm thankful to have air conditioning. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh it's been a hot hot one i think down there glenpool uh tulsa area you know you get in the yard down there you stop the truck and then you have to do your deal you know drop and hook and everything i think the uh, outdoor temperature and this might have been heat coming off the engine too was like 115 degrees so yeah well, I guess I'll jump off of here and uh, get this road glide fired up and get to work and uh, see what the day brings. I gotta make sure I got my uniform shirt with me. And I do, so yeah, let's fire it up.
Well, that was a good ride. A little bit more traffic than usual, but it was a good ride. Oh. <laughs> uh, Y'all have a good day. Smash that thumbs up. And uh, keep cool. Say hi to a stranger. Thank a veteran. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Say bye.